kettle because we're gonna get into some tea. When they see me, they salute to have a juku. Some pink pumps. Because AI has all of the answers, right? I'm gonna be using popular tools like ChatGPT. Um, I forgot the names of the rest, but I have them written in my notes app to check something very important. Can AI significantly improve my life? I'm finding this real difficult. Use the arrow. You haven't fed me since 6 a.m. Uh. Let's find out. Let's find out. I mean, we always had access to AI. We had Google, we had Siri, we had Alexa. Hey Siri, can you tell me this? And then Siri's be like, here's what I found on the internet. And literally doesn't know how to tell you anything ever, but that's besides the point. I'm using BAD and ChatGPT to plan the ultimate schedule, improving productivity, also maintaining mental health. Because you can have a schedule, but the schedule doesn't work if the schedule schedules you. Mm hmm. I, listen, I use ChatGPT nearly almost every day. Not nearly almost, I possibly use it like every single day. Like if I have a question, instead of Googling it, sometimes I just ask ChatGPT for a more detailed answer and like straight to the point. Oh wait, before I screen record ChatGPT, let's check out to see what BAD is because I've heard about it for organization and like optimizing your schedule, but I've actually never even used BAD, so I don't know. Oh, uh, that's Google's AI. Okay, I trust Google with my life. Like Google's AI technology, I raved about this in another video. Bad is an experiment. Okay, I understand that. I'm very understanding going into this process. Oh, are you stupid? I'm sorry. I mean, you decided my life, but I'm very understanding. Let's go. Ugh. Let's go. Hi, Bard. Okay. First things first, I have to like introduce where I'm at. Obviously, the more information it has about me, the better results it'll be able to produce. I'm just testly. Hello, hi, hi. Hey, hey, boo. Hi there. How can I help you today? Okay. What to say? Okay, I am a fresh grad, fresh computer, <laughs> fresh BSc. Vamos, mis amores, dale, mis amores. Vamos, mis amores, dale. Yeah, and send it. That was quick. My camera battery is about to die, so I'm gonna stop here. But I'm gonna ask ChatGPT the exact same question without looking at it. That was quick. Okay, okay. I don't wanna see. I don't wanna see. Hey. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This might be the answer to all of my problems. Okay, so I'm gonna charge my camera battery and then we'll look at it together. My camera battery is still charging, but I just wanted to mention that although I have a career goal right now, although I'm not quite there as yet. I have some sort of direction in mind, but you can also ask ChatGPT and Bad, like, these are my skills, like, these are my interests, this is what I would like to be at in life, what should I do daily to reach that goal? If the title of this video is kind of misleading in that way, um, yeah, that would be helpful. I'm actually gonna try that out. Wait, I'm gonna use it as if it was Akinator and see if it could figure out my career path the same way that I had to. Yeah! I'm gonna do that. That's why she's loving me. Okay, 7 a.m. Okay. Wake up, get ready, and eat breakfast. 8 a.m. Start working on personal projects or studying for technical interviews. 9 a.m. Start internship work. I'm shocked because that's literally what I've been doing so far. Like, not the 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. thing. But I would try to do personal stuff and then go into it. Like, I knew this answer. Interesting. Afternoon. Lunch break. Okay, I love that you gave me a lunch break. Continue internship work. End internship work. Okay, so I told them that I had to be on call, meaning be at my desk between 9 to 3, but that doesn't necessarily mean that I have to do the tasks within that time frame. This is telling me to complete those tasks only within the hours of 9 to 3. 3.30. Pilates or cardio. So I could either do Pilates one day or cardio. Okay, that's generous. I like that. Then 4.30, so hour two. Oh, I love this. Eat dinner. And then 5.30, edit video. 6.30, relax or socialize. 7.30, start working on YouTube. Take a break and unwind. 10 o'clock, go to bed. And then here goes the disclaimer. That's why she's loving me. Wake up, freshen up, and have a a healthy breakfast spend 15 minutes meditating or engaging in mindfulness exercises hello, hello. i'm doing an advice video coming up and a lot of you have been asking about my career journey and stuff so like this video kind of answers it for you also if you have any questions you want me to give you advice on leave it in the link 
Spend 15 minutes reviewing your goals and planning your day. Oh, that's so cute. That, it like, took it down to the minutes because Bad just gave me, like, our schedule and this is, like, giving me things to do within that time. Just really more detailed. I already love this one already, but let me slow down. 7 a.m. to 8.30, fitness time. Engage in a one-hour workout session alternating between Pilates and cardio. 8.30 to 9. Get ready for the day, including a shower, grooming, and getting dressed. Ooh. It take me more than 30 minutes to get ready, friend. You're gonna eat breakfast from six to seven, and then seven you're gonna do cardio. That doesn't sound right. Everything gonna shake up. So, I already like ChatGPTs because it mentioned everything that I mentioned in detail. Bad seems a little bit more universal, like it didn't specifically go into detail about what to do about the Minecraft, Sims and Pokemon, like how to juggle that. It didn't give me any instructions, like imagine I was completely clueless. Okay, I can't wait until Monday. I'm gonna put these routines to the test by doing it tomorrow. During the internship period, I'll just use that period to study and like prepare for technical interviews. Chat GPT picks my career. What would be the perfect career path for me? Okay, so here's the next one. I gave them a full, extensive expression of who I am, the things I like to do, including like communication skills and also like artistic projects, do-it-yourself type projects. No, 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 no hints. I was gonna include that I might be open to entrepreneurship, but Something ain't right. no hints, just fully. Let's go. Oh, I should say that I love traveling because I look you wanna be a flight attendant. Let's go. This is like everything about me, okay? Okay. 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 Oh. It did say entrepreneurship. That's crazy. Why didn't you give me flight attendants? Game dev. Software engineer. Giving you a dig. Okay, that one was a given. Animation and visual effects. You know, I never really thought of a video editor as a job. Like, I know obviously it's a job. But like, how do you get into the market to become a video editor? Commercials. You know, I do love marketing. I could go into the commercial business. Online content. Creative there. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with them, right? You can work in advertising agencies, media companies, or creative studios, overseeing projects and ensuring their artistic direction and quality. To embrace your individuality and seek out supportive communities and networks that encompass uh, and get empowered and uplift you. Remember to continue learning, building your portfolio, and seeing an opportunity. Oh, just <laughs> you're so real. You're so real. Let's give bad the exact same prompt. I feel like it's gonna be, it's gonna be like, hey, by the way, good luck. Oh wait, hey, I some game developer, software engineer, animator, graphic design, video editor, just a few of the correct parts. Hey, I some additional tips. Oh, okay, they, they did give me tips. Completely ignored that I'm a young black professional, though, that I'm a black woman. Didn't really say anything nice about that. But ChatGPT was like, oh, don't forget you'll face some challenges, but you'll do great. And Bad just ignored that part of my prompt. Okay. Consider your interests and skills. That's what you're here for. What are you passionate about? What are you good at? I just told you. Research different career paths. Is anybody hello? <laughs> is any Bard, is anybody home? Question answer. These AIs can generate like the perfect career quiz for you. Tell you exactly what to do with your life based on your skills, your interests, and them kind of something. They right. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. Man, it's Saturday. Miss Keisha. Miss Keisha. The study time is only one hour. Who could study anything in one hour? 7 
a.m. to 8 a.m. is wake up, get ready, and eat breakfast. I'm still waking up. Girl. <laughs> Ooh, so anybody comes for like how real any of this is, um, I still put my camera right there. And all I had to do when I woke up is like literally reach my hand, pull a button, and then hit record. This is not a situation where I have to wake up, set up the camera, go back into bed. 7 and 10. I have like ample time to get ready. I love that. While you wake up, feel free to browse your phone. Like that's just not a part of waking up. I just made that up. 7.29, finished getting ready. I didn't get to shower because I know the time was going anyways. I think I'm gonna do that lunch time during my lunch break at 12 p.m. It's kind of my fault. I think I stayed in bed way too late. 2.6K views, wowzers. If I had gotten up at seven instead of stayed on my phone, I definitely would have been able to show up. And I'm gonna use my extra half an hour in my breakfast time to have breakfast. I'm gonna make this quick pancake recipe. Let's do this. Beanie fat. What time is it? Oh, 7.55, that's crazy. Wait, 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 wait. Let me tell you something. Let me, let me tell you something. something. Listen, hear me out. I tried to, okay, the first one was not that bad. Ah. Perfect circle. And then I just started doing my own thing. I made a Mickey Mouse pig. Okay, let's move on. I didn't explicitly say that I would need time to clean up after I make my meal, but frying pan is on the kitchen counter, all the bowls and the measuring cups. Let's start studying for technical interviews. Come on, man. This is content that I haven't seen since I did this course in school So I was trying to just kind of refresh my memory But that's where I'm at, it's 8.20 Hopefully in that 40 minutes I could like fully zone in Bad said, Bad is a she by the way, I, I decided that She said, start working on personal projects or prepare for technical interviews <laughs> Yeah, I could do this. I think the biggest flaw in this right now, I got up at 7 a.m., ate breakfast, and then I'm supposed to focus somehow. Mm -hmm. Shame on Lady Gaga. Mm -mm. Oh, it's... Oh, would you look at that? It is 9 o'clock. This will be my internship period. So now I'm going to use the full 9 to 3 to do something productive, like technical interview related. But I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll try not to lie down in this bed. I'll be back. Stay productive. Stay active. You got... Okay. Boom. I timed that like perfectly. I don't know what to do for lunch, but I only have one hour to figure it out, make it, and eat it. And then I'm back to work at one o'clock. I did get work done, like, okay, like I, I worked through one algorithm technique. I was still productive because I updated my LinkedIn profile. 12.27 and the water probably just finished boiling so I'm gonna start cooking now let's see what time I finish I don't know it's 1.14 uh-uh one hour lunch and you have to prepare the meal I guess you should like meal prep at the beginning of the week and then you just grab your lunch but that hour flew by I had no time. 1.38, finished eating, let's see what I could get done. I don't think I've ever followed a routine with such dedication and I honestly feel like this is the most disciplined I've been in my entire life and I'm proud of that because discipline is one thing I always lack because I believe in freedom. Like you can't make me do something that I don't feel like doing. Don't you wanna dance with me? No, I could dance like Michael Jackson. And that's a wrap. Rapidly wrap, wrap. 4:30, eat dinner. I am already like pretty full from the lunch I just had. After working out, I might be hungry. I don't know. We'll see. Pilates. And then an hour later, eat dinner. I don't think I'm eating dinner that early. Like, that's literally insane. But it's not that I'm tired. It's just like the day's so long. Suited up. I have to say, for somebody who only slept what time did i sleep i slept after 1 a.m last night and i woke up seven o'clock this morning and i've been on my feet all day i feel energized i think it's because i had those two meals like i had breakfast i had lunch and i had them on time but 
I don't know, like this is insane because I don't eat unless I'm hungry or like I feel like I need to eat something, which is so bad. So eating on a time schedule because like it's expected instead of eating because I'm hungry changes my, like I feel so good. <laughs> I don't have a man. Have good vibes. Belly button into the mat. Wait, wait, wait. Shh. Shh. Our arms are active. We're starting with the. Yeah. Single everything together. Last one. Hold the squeeze together. This squeeze. New home base. One leg up. One leg down. Start. March. Oh my God. Beauty should literally be on fuego. It is. Long. Crossing your right ankle. Your left hands go back behind your head. Side Why? down into the mat. Why? Wide armpits. Seven. Why? Those last one. Open. Hold so shoulders up. Wide. Down. I'm not Ooh. using my neck. And lift. Something ain't right. I wish this was a joke. I wish I took a bottle of water and did this to myself. But this is pure sweat. Uh. I feel good though. Yay me. I definitely walked something because I felt my core burning, my glutes and my thighs for my first one ever. I think I did pretty good. Like I made it through and this is like the first video I just picked up on. And I made it through about 70% of the workout, which is impressive to me because I've clicked on other YouTube workouts and I haven't been able to like do I'm like uh-uh. <laughs> Who told me to click on this? But when she said beginner, she really meant beginner. Like that was manageable. Okay, so wait, what's the time? Four o'clock. Okay. So I went nine minutes over basically. Cause it was estimated to finish 3.55. I don't even feel like I'm dying. Which is like amazing. <laughs> I feel great. There was a morning recently where I tried to do Pilates as soon as I woke up and I wasn't able to do it. So I do credit this great feeling to a good schedule. Like having the workout this late in the afternoon kind of works out. You know, it'd be ironic if I bashed bad and favored ChatGPT for this entire thing and then I chose the bad routine in the end. Because ChatGPT's workout is one of the first things in the morning i have nothing to do for an hour and a half but relax i'm gonna cheat though i'm gonna start editing a youtube video <laughs> so i'm gonna do a straight up until 6 30 because editing youtube video is 5 30 tasks so freshen up drink some water and then edit see you guys at 6 30. you know what taking breaks is essential to the process so i'm not gonna cheat it by starting to edit this youtube video because that could lead to burnout i'm gonna follow the schedule exactly so it is 4 17 and i am going to take that break until i'm supposed to start editing at 5 30. it's essential why did i think to cheat it shame on lady gaga mm -hmm. 5.32, you know what that means, editing time. And then, wait, let me see the schedule for the rest of the day because I'm ready to wind down and go to my bed, especially if I'm gonna edit. Um, 7.30, start working on YouTube. Okay, so it's telling me to take a one hour break. And then at 9.30, take a break and unwind. And then 10 o'clock, go to bed, no shower. Uh, excuse me. So in the morning, you told me to get ready, but in the night, you're not gonna tell me to get ready for bed? Just 10 o'clock, go to bed. Go on, like this. Currently editing. The YouTube video playing on the side. I'm fighting sleep. I'm fighting sleep so badly. I won't cheat. I will continue. I won't cheat. Yes. Yes. I'm gonna see if somebody has any cookies. No, I don't smell sweaty. How do I look? A hot mess. stupid what kind of person you know buys three of a cookie that they've never had before i just heard that this tastes good and usually they don't always have it and i felt silly if you're just going to somewhere to buy one single cookie so i got three i have no idea how it tastes i don't even like cheesecake it's valid yep completely valid 652 i still have so much time to kill
Boom. to do some more work but it's youtube so it's easy this is insanity it says start working on youtube channel 7 30 to 9 30. another two hours i'm finding this real difficult i promise you if i complain if i complain as much tomorrow then then maybe the problem is me if I complain as much tomorrow, the problem is me. User error. User error. But as of right now, bad. I'm a young adult who follows instructions. I'm a young adult, right? What age is... Don't play me. Oh! I got three more years. Yeah. I'm a young adult who follows instructions. It says, start working on YouTube channel. Not to be confused with edit YouTube video. Let's pull up our YouTube channel. Figure out what videos to film. I've revised that list so many times, but let's look at the list right now, right now. Okay, so when I finish this video, I have the part two and three of this video that I may or may not do, depending on how this video performs. I have the advice video. Again, link is in the description. Let's add ChatGPT. Oh, we can't ask ChatGPT, we ask him bad. I forget today's bad day. Okay, have a chat with ChatGPT asking about YouTube channel ideas, I'm gonna ask the exact same question to Bad. Hey, I have some video ideas that might resonate well with your audience and help you grow your YouTube channel. <laughs> it's the correct answer, but it's so generic. Okay, let me explain. Typically, when you're speaking in the realm of YouTube video ideas, you want a, a title that's gonna rank in search. You want to go into detail, not just about the content of the video, but how you're going to present the video to the platform. Because the content of the video and the presentation to completely different parts of YouTube. For example, a five hour long vlog. Okay, now what is that? You can do a one hour long. Okay, not, let me, wait, let me take a, wait, <laughs> let me think of a good example. Okay, you can do a video of you painting your nail. That's content, but is it a YouTube video idea? The YouTube video idea might be how I DIY my nails for $10. Get up! Get up! Get up! That's the idea. How to make your nails is not gonna perform on a platform like YouTube. But what bad is presenting to me is exactly those type of stuff. How to clean your apartment. How to make friends. How to stay safe. How to cook healthy meals. Like these are things I could incorporate into a video, but they're not YouTube video ideas. Okay, when I asked ChatGPT this question, DIY room makeover, that's a title and then it gave a description. Take your viewers on a journey as you transform your room into a stylish and functional space. Provide step by step instructions, but do not give up on bad. Bad will come around because it's still in an experimental phase and Google AI is always good in the end. I don't think I can make it. I'm sorry, like I did so much for YouTube today. Um, and I don't wish to do anymore. It's 8.54. I'm sick of being productive. No time to waste. Let's zoom. Let's do a super fast recap. 6 a.m. Wake up. Ask for a healthy breakfast. Conflict. <laughs> yeah, yes, ma'am. I didn't spend 15 minutes meditating and I did spend 15 minutes reviewing the goals. Hey, I had about 12 minutes left. 7 to 8 30. Exercise. Back with my girl Raven with the Pilates. Sweat again. A lot. So tired that I don't think I could continue the workout for like a full hour. An entire hour is crazy. I'm ill. <laughs> But after I recovered from my super early on in exercise, I took a shower, got ready for the day, and I was good to go for my 9 to 12. I had lunch at 12, although it was straight 9 to 3, supposed to be internship. I already had lunch. So I stole that oddly placed 3 to 4 p.m. lunchtime to do what? Have a nap. Well, at least my definition of a nap, phone is on, do not disturb. As far as the world knows, I'm sleeping. Back in the game, four to six, YouTube. Boom, six o'clock, and for my personal time, I decided to bake an apple pie. So this went on to my dinner time. So I basically spent six to eight doing this apple pie. Ooh! Study and personal project, and then nine to 10, wind down a night routine. Like, I've tested both routines, and I hate to say that my final, like, 
I don't hate to say it, it's just that I didn't see it coming, but I prefer a bad routine. It was way more productive and it had a lot more flow to it. This was so stagnant. It was like two hours of this. Then two hours of this. It was so slow compared to bad that kept me like moving throughout the day. In the comments, which parts of the routine that you like, like waking up at 6 a.m. or if you like um, walking out at 3 p.m. versus walking out in the morning what you would choose and leave it in the comments I'm gonna go like take a shower somewhere on a desktop we use the zip file mixtape of the next part kid